Well, the lighting is weird. The light is... I should not stand at this position. Well, when I graduated from high school, my mother told me to either get a job or do summer school. Well, if you're able to read the title and notice a specific series on my channel, then congratulations! You're smart and you can tell what I chose. Hi! My name is... What? My name is... What? My name is... Madeline. The intro implies, hi, my name is Madeline Jensen, and today I will be telling you why I got chose to get a job over taking summer classes. Let's get started. Well, the most obvious reason is because going from elementary to high school, I did a lot of summer school, and I had enough of that. Seriously, I had enough. But that's not the only reason, now that I think about it. Growing up with autism, I know my parents wanted me to be, was hoping rather that I would become more independent. I mean, in case I didn't become the person who I was today after I graduated, they signed me up for a lot of programs. So the fact that I have a job and I am one semester away from graduating, that shows them. But it's great to have a job and make my own money so I can do stuff. I'm gonna say how to say this. Um, basically, let's just say if I did choose summer school over a job, I, a, would not have gone to VidCon my first year. B, I would never have experienced how awesome it was. C, I would have never met my VidCon brothers blue band films and even visit them during, um, during my spring break last year in Michigan. D, wouldn't have known the amazing people that I met this past VidCon. And E, wouldn't have celebrated my birthday with my YouTube family at PAX. In serious, that was amazing. Plus. It's good to save. I mean, right now I plan on saving for when I transfer in a year. I know I'm taking a year break from school just to focus on my job, learn how to save and apply. Those who may wonder if they who may are debating on if they want to do summer classes or get a job, if you want to get your degrees faster, then go to summer school. I mean, it's hell anyway. But if you're like me and you want to experience these ama this, all this amazing stuff like VidCon, Pack South, the new video game systems, um, learning how to save, buying your own house, buying your own car even, and it may be a good idea to pick get a job. I mean, you can try and do both. I mean, I would, if you want to do both, then go for it. And plus, working at the place I do now, I've met a lot of amazing people who I can call my family, okay, I could call my work family, some of my bestest friends. I know that a coworker and I are planning to see the Power Rangers movie together when it comes out. And if I didn't get that job, that probably wouldn't have even happened. Plus the store that I work at, it's a great, I love the community there. Um, everyone's really close and it's just amazing. My lighting thing fell! Oh well, I'm gonna give you that bad. So if you ever want to go to VidCon and your parents aren't willing to pay for you, get a job. I mean, it's great to spend your own money rather than ask your parents for a few hundred dollars for a ticket. And plus, I knew my mom wasn't going to pay all that stuff for me. She wouldn't, she wouldn't buy my ticket, my plane ticket, hotel reservations, no. She wouldn't do, she probably wouldn't have done any of that. So, and plus, like I said, I was sick of summer school, guys. If you've been to summer school all your life, I feel your pain. It's horrid having to wake up early in the morning and go to school for like a nor like a, as long as a school day. Like it was rough. Like I think I should now make a video on some summer school stories. I end up doing that. So there's the reasons, mostly the main reasons why I chose a job over summer school. Which one would you pick and why? Let me know in the comment section down below. And thank you so much for watching. It's someone's birthday around the world, so happy birthday to that someone. Make sure you hit that button down there that says subscribe for more random content every Thursday. Boop, boop, boop. My name is Madeline Jensen, and as always, I will see you next Thursday. Peace out, y'all.